Police say the homeowners woke to four people trying to break into their home. That's when one of them pulled out a shotgun and opened fire. You can see the blood stains here on the ground. They had a fire truck over here and they had all that blocked off over there. And you could see somebody laying, laying down over there. William Jones says his neighbor's been robbed before and was probably just fed up with being targeted again. News 4 WOAI has learned the thieves were also stealing ATVs parked in the backyard when the homeowner walked out with his gun. I heard like three consecutive gunshots, bow, 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 and then a, a pause, and then some more gunshots, and then another pause, and then one more. Three men got away in a red Camaro. Now, some neighbors fear for their own safety. Like, you don't think nothing when something like that happens. We just, you just try to protect your, your family. Yeah. Like, I came to the room with my, my girls to see if they were okay. Others can't believe what happened. I think it's scary. I mean, because of uh, all these uh, elementary schools here and all the kids, you know, going by and all this. The 34 year old suspect who was shot is expected to recover. He's over at Wilford Hall Hospital. If you know anything about the other three suspects, you're urged to give police a call. On the south side, Christina Delion, News 4, WOAI.